Hey guys, so today I'm actually going to be doing a video and I'm going to be showing you guys how to make these awesome pillows so I know there's a whole um, thing on room decker and room decker is actually really expensive like really nice room decker is expensive so I found that pillows are a big accent to the bed but um yeah I'm not about to pay 40 bucks for a pillow no and I found a good way to make myself my own pillow and yeah I mean look how cute it looks so I got my inspiration off this picture that I'm going to show you guys right here and I just really loved everything was set up the colors and everything so I decided hey let's make my own I got mine at the fabric store and it was only five dollars for um all this material but I got two, so 10 bucks for two pillows. Awesome! So I hope you guys really enjoyed the tutorial because it was so easy. I give it a difficulty of about uh, four, a five around there. It's easy, but it's just really time consuming. So I didn't go ahead and measure anything. I just eyeballed everything. And that's how the turkey did it. That's just exactly how the turkey did it. <laughs> Okay, so let's get started. You're going to be needing fabric glue and scissors, and you're also going to be needing your choice of material and a really old pillow, and this is the one I chose. So you're going to want to lay out all the fabric out and place the pillow on top so you are able to make your guideline. I'm just assuming just as much material as I'm going to need, but go ahead and make your own guideline. So after that, you're just going to want to start cutting it and just cut all the way through so you're going to have extra material left. So you can use that for whatever you want, making bows, lamps, whatever. So you just want to put that to the side. After that, you want to place your pillow on one of the corners and just fold it over making sure both sides are absolutely even. So it's kind of like wrapping a gift up. What you want to do is you want to fold in the corners and glue on the sides. So this, you don't have to worry about covering up the border of it so because this is going to be tucked in so next what you want to do is you actually want to glue the side as I'm going to be doing right here I actually don't want any harsh lines on the side so I'm just going to go ahead and be folding that in since this is the part that's actually going to be showing on the outside you want to put a little bit more glue I mean a lot more glue and you kind of want to just fold that up and it's just easy as that If you guys have any questions on how to do this, please make sure to leave me a comment and if you guys did it, I'd really love to see how yours turned out. Lame. But either way, baby, I'm going. 